Why are you calling me? You still haven't said yes to the pounded yam. And I will haunt you until you cook for me, old woman. See, truth be told, I didn't make that food. I figured, with your mom pinching Shalewano. So why are you harassing me then? I am very certain you know how to cook. Why? Because I'm fat. Come on, I, I, I didn't say that. So what are you saying then? Look, just cook for me. Don't you start to make me say insulting stuff, then you'll now be angry and say you don't want to cook. Okay, I've heard. See, I need to go. My phone is ringing. Have another call. Who? Your new boyfriend? He's not my boyfriend. Bye. Hi, what's up? Hi, sleep good? Yeah. I'm becoming hot commodity. My market's selling and I'm loving it. Let's see what, let's see what come on. and until they fight. Nathan, let me call you back. Ah! Until when you get married, eh? You can come back, then we talk about it. Until then, you have a Marriage? Is that the only thing you talk about? Yes! Maybe if you did something else, asidely for your husband and kids, you will know that marriage isn't a hey, happening. Look at you. And you say complete, and you don't know it. No, it isn't. But marriage isn't everything. Sister, you're married. Look at you, but you don't work. Kilo The only thing you do is sit in the house, rub powder, eat, sleep, go to church. Ah, ah, and you think all oh, this is fun for Uncle Jaye? Ah. For someone who claims to love you so much, he hardly stays in the house. All he does is go on business trips. Ah, ah, because he has too much of you, he has to take you in small doses. Ah! Emi! Emi, no buye! Sister, ma buyiju. Ma buyiju. Ah! Yes! My boy is getting cocky no day! Do I? Sister, you are married, okay? Fine! Ah, but the only thing you do is cook! So, yo! I got your money, but I can for you. But she said, I can't go. You are making a offer salad. Are you a booker? Are you a booker? Ah, ah! Look at you. You did not upgrade yourself. But yet, Uncle Jaya has surpassed you. Ah, see? Yet, you carry, you carried your husband on your head. Ah, you know his girlfriend. Can I say it? Ah, sister, maybe even as we speak, your husband is jollificating with his girlfriend. Who knows? When I married my husband and I begged him to pay for your useless school that you did not go to. Do why you did not know that he had a girlfriend then? Yes, we caught him with a girl. But he has changed. My husband has changed. Okay, didn't Richard, didn't he give you a ring? When Richard gave you a ring, did you accept to marry him? Simply because of her, she shows she only broke out of her and she did not know. It's not because you of her. You are very bad. Because of it. It's not because, because of that, sister. It's because I cannot have ah. children. Me only be more because I removed my room. If you cannot have children, shame me more, dear Bunny. If you can't have children, Go! Back and go! Go and have children! Leave my house! They let me there! Sister. Sister. Ah! Sister, fine. I, I, I didn't marry him because I couldn't have kids. Hey, go ahead, and I told him he wanted to marry me, but I told him I couldn't. Me only chef now. And I told him, go marry somebody else and have kids. Sister, not all of us will get married. Not all of us will have kids. The earlier you know that the better. I am going back to Abuja, okay? I will go. Go. Because I have works anyway. Go! Sister, you have your family. Love them. I will love my money. I will go. Do you know why I come here? I come here because I love you and I love your kids. Like they are mine. It's okay. Sister, I beg of you to not force Tiwa to make sacrifices like you did. You found love in your marriage quite alright. Let her find love that will lead to marriage. I will go to Abuja. I will go. I'm sorry you were not meant to hear that. Auntie Dupsi. 
can't believe these two people push themselves to the point whereby they expose so much. I blame mommy. I understand that she believes in what she believes in, but she doesn't need to shove it down everybody's throats every single time. I mean, look at what she did to Auntie Dupe. <sighs> Auntie, how are you getting to the airport? My friend's driver is downstairs. So I take care of you, take care of Shalewa. And anytime you want to unwind, just come to Abuja. We'll travel out of the country together, okay? <sighs> Don't get pressured. When the time comes, you will know, okay? Come here, Tony! Come on, leave me alone! Should have married him. Eh? Why did I bad for more? After all, it's God that gives children. Eh? He does the impossibility. He's a God of every possibility, for God's sake. Kill all the God. Mommy's okay. Ah, my dear boy, mommy. Ask the boy, mommy. I push you, bro. Until what I do? Waiting. Mommy cook food for until we just go and the sausage they big. And me, I don't like to throw away food and and food where they fry. No, no good for me. Come on, get out of here, Joe. Who cares? Get out! Stupid girl. Sibling rivalry. That's what we're talking about today. I have a younger sister, Shali Wali, and she does my head in. I love her to bits though. We argue, we fight. Sometimes she takes my stuff, sometimes. But the point is, how do siblings ever get to where they cannot communicate anymore? Where the love is lost? Where you are fighting over property, you're fighting over the littlest things. Brothers going to see Babalawos to do jazz on their sisters. When do you get to that point where you've crossed the line? Where the competition is no longer healthy? Call in and let me know what you think. Sibling rivalries still on the gist with Tiwa. Hey girl, look what came in for you. <laughs> Is Mide okay? Uh -uh. Wait, what makes you think it's his from Mide? He's been disturbing me about cooking for him since and says he'll continue to bug me if I don't. Hmm. I think that's just an excuse to be close to you. I beg me, I don't know, please. We're trying to work on our friendship. Ha! Oh, I could literally cut the tension in the air at your birthday dinner. All his body was just tense everywhere. I beg now, you sabi. Oh, <laughs> it's from Nathan. Hey! Ha! If she, mom boutique, you have them in different forms and different sizes. Please, can you borrow me one item? Get out of here, just shut up. Oh, had an amazing time the other night. Can we do it again? Hmm. So are you going to do it again? Well... Tiwa. What? Beg man cannot come and go and die. <laughs> it's know, quite right? sweet, sir. She get open up to get you one a day. What can I beg for then? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> ah, good afternoon, ma. So it's true. All you do is come in here to gossip? Uh, no, Ma. Ma, I was having like a scheduling problem, so Didi was trying to help me fix it. Thank you, Didi. Uh, yeah. Food. In the studio. Ma, it was delivered and... And... It couldn't stay in the reception? <laughs> what, did you think it would get lonely? Ma... Don't worry, don't worry. I'll pity you this time. Since you've already been fined. But it's shocking. A former head of programming? You've broken so many rules since I've been here. No wonder you resigned. This seed that Hadiza has planted, it will be uprooted in the name of Jesus. Ah, ah! What did I do to that girl? With a share husband? I need you to go to Abuja for a media conference. You'll be representing this company and you will be speaking. What would I be talking about, Ma? I don't know yet. I'll let you know before you leave. When would that be? Next weekend. Tiwa. 
Behave yourself. You're representing this company. And there'll be media houses from all over Africa. So I implore you to impress me. Yes, ma'am. My secretary will get you your itinerary, and you'll be given cash for your accommodation if you do. Bonsoir, mademoiselle. Bonsoir, Bakai. You were at the conference earlier on. My name is Fabrice. Tiwalade. Can I join you? It's a public place. I don't own the bar. So, you work on the radio? What exactly do you do? Thank you. I talk mainly. I have a show. We address different issues, and the listeners call in and give opinions, and we we ah. share opinions. Perfect. Mm. What do you do? I own studios, production studios, and a TV station. Wow. Here? No, Cote d'Ivoire. So you speak French perfectly. Oui, mon français est parfait. Your French is perfect. Yes, yeah. good. You can be perfect yourself in just a few weeks. <laughs> I have a tutor as hot as you. I'll be eager to learn. Hey, did I just majorly flirt with this guy? Boy, he's hot. <laughs> Guys like this don't usually walk up to me. Oh. And when they do, they always friend zone me. So, what are you doing tonight? Finishing this glass and going to bed. Alone? Of course alone. Well, you never know. You might have a sexy booty call on speed dial. I am not that kind of girl. Trust me, no one is until they are. Touche. So, are you staying at this hotel or you live close by? Staying at the hotel, I actually live in Lagos. I have a flight to catch tomorrow. Perfect. That means you can stay up all night and be naughty. We, oui. <laughs> But I can't stay up all night though. I need to sleep. I have an early flight tomorrow. I see my presence is aiding your French, mademoiselle. Maybe. So what's your room number? I need to change first. But my room number is 737. Let's say uh, I'll give you about three to two hours. You good? Knocking to. Perfect. So I'll see you then. See you then. Is it looking? <laughs> Hello? You are still sleeping at 1 p.m. Is your flight not 2 o'clock in one morning? 1 p.m.? What's going on? Is someone there with you, Nick? No, Mom, it's the television. My flight was changed later on this evening. Eh? Oh, yeah, the decola where go back in so that you will be at the airport early. Okay, Ma. I'll call you when I check in. Okay. Hold up, Bao. Alright. Bye, Nikki Lishi. I'm cutting me to you. I want something I will be eating when I am watching movie, okay? Okay, mommy, bye. Ow! That was my mother. Oh, this is Merci. Okay. So, you missed your flight? Yes, and it's all your fault. And I have to buy a new ticket and pay an extra night for my hotel room. Oui, but I should make up for it. How? By paying for everything extra that you have to do. But only one condition. You are not giving condition. Yeah, yeah, what? One more hour to show you Lomo <laughs> What's that? Yoshi. <laughs> Ah, 
Ozi. I'm back! I'm back, baby! <laughs> Oh, How was your journey? <laughs> Mommy, it was good, though. It was good. Okay. But I'm tired. Uh -uh. <laughs> Women have come earlier. Yeah, what happened to your two o'clock? Small delay. Did you say to the pay? Of course I did. Now, Mommy, she said I should greet you. <laughs> and she has my number. Oh, call your baby, me, Jerry. I don't like come. Wait till you bring come. Myself. And I don't see you now. You know, bring Kilichi. When I saw her, I'm a war of her. Are you the one that asks for Kilichi? Hey, mommy, you know, no say if Kilichi, they will go to chop them as they watch TV. You see? Eh? Small talk to my mom and say, Oh, did you hear me come and play tape recorder? Eh? Who asked you to play, press play? Yeah. Hello, Bia? I should be a business woman. Eh? Did you say something? No. I'm sorry, my dad is so. Why did you tell me my dad is so? Why did you tell me my Mommy, you self. Why are you talking to her like that now? What's it? Don't worry. I brought Kilichi for you too. <coughs> I like that one. Mm, girl, I've gist for you <laughs> and Dambunama. As expected. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> hey, uh, don't I deserve the gist? Uh, Mom, it's not for old people. Yeah, but bear any old people. Mm. Uh, kilo papa. <laughs> <laughs> See, I need to tell somebody about what happened in Abuja. I just feel like a whole me. I need to tell someone about what happened in Abuja, big. Oh, you are. I beg, let's go and cheese. Please leave me here. Let's go, let's go. Mommy and then we'll see you later. Sure. Allow me to take me to Tiwa, so you are trying to tell me that you had sex with a total stranger. He wasn't too <laughs> Like a one night stand. See. You're making it sound as if now I was one a shower that I picked up from the bar. What's the difference now? Later you now carry wig and hammer and before me in judge. I feel somehow now, eh? Better feel it too. Better feel it. But how was it? I can't describe it. Can I be honest? Please, I need the truth right now. I am so jealous of you. Like, if it was me, I fall on the ivory coast. Tete, I won't come back. Why did I come back? Like, I don't understand. Huh. He's calling. Please put it on speaker, please. Hello? Ça va, ma chérie? Ça va bien, et vous? Parfait, except that you're on the next team. So? Did you get home safe? Yes, I did. Still at the hotel? Wait, off to London in the morning. Oh, nice. I was wondering, if I'm ever in town again, would you like to have drinks? Fabrice, my heart belongs to someone else. What we... You, you were great, but... We can only be friends. Like, if I see you right now, I don't even think I'll be able to look you in the eye. I'm not this person. I understand. I see no reason why we cannot be friends. I didn't ask for anything more than that. Abiu. Shh. We can be. Okay, Sherry. I will call you soon. Okay. I'm available for an encore anytime. <laughs> Tempting. Yeah, I want to call Au revoir, ma chérie. Au revoir, Fabrice. Hey! Tiwa. Shui. Tiwa, mm. give me this man now. I will use him well. Shut up. Ha! Please now. Kai. This one is calling because he's looking for Nigerian booty call. Huh. But this consulate is closed for business. Huh. I had a one night stand. Who would have thought? Me. But whatever happens in Abuja, stays in Abuja. It stays in Abuja, oh my sister. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I hope you use protection no? before you now come and burn French baby. Shut up there. Okay now. Nah. At least. Just shall hope you use. Thanks. Did you see my missed calls and all my messages? My phone was on silent. I went running. Haba, Haba, Tiwa. You can't be doing things like this now. There might be emergencies. Ah, 
Anyway, have you spoken to him? No, I haven't. Why? I don't know how to say this, but babes, eh? There's a scandal brewing and I really, really need you to be calm. I'm calm now. Tell me what's going on or should I go on in the kitchen and check? 